Hi everybody, Camp Master here again. Today we're going to uh, have chicken and rice. We're going to smoke the chicken. But first we're going to soak it in uh, some marinade, brine, whatever you want to call it. I guess it's a little bit of brine because we have salt in it. But So first thing we're going to do is add a little beer in there. See how it tastes first. I figure it's five o'clock somewhere. So there's a beer. Um, have a tablespoon of spicy salt. A heaping tablespoon of minced garlic. Some kicking chicken seasoning and some crushed red pepper. We're also going to add some um, the original Huli Huli sauce. Mix this up. Again, our chicken will probably go on 225. Um, not sure what kind of wood we're going to smoke with today. We might do hickory. I got a competition wood in there right now. We'll change it out to some hickory. Get our chicken in there. We're going to have to make it all fit. bigger than I thought. So um, here in a couple hours I'm gonna have to come back and, and flip this because my container I underestimated. So we'll be back in a little bit um, and take off from where we left off. See y'all. Hey everybody, Camp Master we're back getting ready to put stuff on the grill. So we're gonna uh, cook at 275 we need an internal temp of 165 minimum for the chicken. Uh, we're probably looking at about two, maybe two and a half hours at the most. I think we're gonna have uh, white rice with it, and that's probably about it. Sounds pretty good. Um, so let me get these thrown on the smoker, and we'll be back with you guys in just a little bit. Alright everybody, we'll be back in a couple hours, we'll let you know how it tastes. Camp Master guys, we're back, chicken's done, uh, 275, uh, cooked it for just a little bit over two hours, got an internal temp of 165, I'm um, usually pretty, pretty careful with the chicken, so I left it there for, I don't know, about five minutes, just to make sure that it was done, I always take a knife and cut into a, to a piece of it. But it looks pretty good. Skin looks nice and crispy. It smells delicious. Moist. As you can hear. So if you give us just a couple minutes to uh, get our plates made, and we'll, uh, we'll let everybody know how it was. We'll see y'all in just a minute. Hi guys, Camp Master again. We're gonna see how this tastes. Abigail likes it, that's for sure. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, let's see how it is. The skin's definitely crispy, nice and moist. Um, looks like the bone just, it's just falling off the bone, everybody. <laughs> definitely good, definitely moist, and um, 
Mm. Man, that's good. We're going to have to make that again. Enjoy, everybody. Have a good night. Hey, everybody. I had to come back before we end this and a uh, few more things on the chicken we just had. So I forgot to tell you that I let it marinate for about four hours. Also, um, I'm not a real big chicken fan. Don't get me wrong. I love my chicken wings and, and drums, uh, you know, super spicy. But other than that, I'm not a big chicken fan. But um, this chicken was actually outstanding. You could taste the uh, kicking chicken seasoning in it. I did not get a whole lot of garlic taste out of it. Um, didn't get a whole lot of salt taste out of it either, but I definitely got the, uh, the kicking chicken seasoning and the huli huli sauce. So if you're not a big chicken fan, definitely give this one a try because we'll be having it a lot more often in my house. Um, have a good night, everybody. Uh -huh.